good morning guys we are out here at mountain bay state recreational trail right across the street here it is about 83 miles long so and i believe that's just one way <clears throat> could be mistaken but we're gonna get on this uh crushed stone trail which you can probably see And we're doing 18 miles this morning, so let's get it in. Right off the trail here, but a quarter mile in. Whew. Temperatures this morning are quite chilly, actually. It's probably about, I'd say, 38 or 40 degrees. Um, my hands are kind of chilly, but I just got this new craft. Um, hydro rain jacket pretty much um but you can wear it for cold mornings and stuff like that too um but it has like a little a little mitten to put your hands um which really is nice if you don't want to bring gloves along um but yep just working it up right now and probably gonna drop this top within the next mile or so Pretty beautiful views back here though. Yeah, just 18 miles this morning. Taking it pretty easy, it's a recovery week. Last week we did that 80 miles. Um, we're dropping it back down to 54 this week. And the Saucony Endorphin Speed 2s today. sun's coming up now it's gonna be a beautiful day out probably 60 degrees at, at least um, but enjoying mountain bay i mean it's just one straight shot so you're going through a lot of wooded area no real elevation here crushed limestone less impact um, but this past week i've been dealing with a lot of fatigue uh, the body's just uh you know multiple 20 plus mile runs two 30 mile runs within the month um, just the body's not used to that yet, uh, as we're on this journey of, uh, ultra running, but we'll get there. We'll definitely get there. Uh, but it's just interesting to kind of deal with that fatigue. Uh, calorie intake needs to be way up there, um, which I thought I'd been pretty good about, but I still think I could cram more calories in. Um, but yeah, overall, another solid week. Nice little addition to the forest here. You know, our friendly gnomes live in these trees. about nine miles in just gonna push it to 10 and end up doing a 20 today um, just kind of in a flow state and feeling good so I might as well take advantage of it um, I do have about 11 miles tomorrow then if I do do 20 today but no issue undecided where I'll run tomorrow maybe on the trail uh, or on the roads undecided we'll see how the legs feel later tonight Yeah, 15 miles. Uh, legs are feeling good. Just popped in the tunes. Now I'm kind of using it as a tool now rather than just wearing them all the time. Um, but yeah, I popped them in at 14 miles about. And listening to some tunes now. And just relaxing into the run. And Good morning, guys. We are just out here at Baird's Creek, of course. And we're gonna get about 11 miles in today. So, right off of that 20 miler from yesterday, uh, which legs are feeling great, push the calories, and 
and uh, yeah, we're gonna get into some nature here and enjoy uh, scenic views. Hope you like my sock and shoe combination today. We got the Nike Wild Horse Sevens. Good morning. <laughs> All right, back to the trail. Heading up this climb here, just about four miles in. Yeah, but a pretty decent recovery week. Um, like I said, keeping that mileage just at 55. Actually, I think it's 54, but whatever. Um, and then we'll bump it back up over 75 next week. Just kind of giving the legs a break. Um, you know, for Wisconsin, I did do 5,000 feet of elevation last week too. So try to keep that under 2,500 this week. So, But here's my car over there. Still the only one here. Just crested about 6 a.m. Just feels good to be out here in shorts and t-shirt though, above all else. The freedom of movement. And also, feeling that sun beat on your skin is just so essential. Um, especially here in Wisconsin, we don't get the best UV. Um, like most people, supplementing vitamin D is our best bet. Of these little switchbacks here. Nothing crazy, but enough for uh, me to get some work done on the legs. It's gonna wrap up uh, this video. You know, double training session in this video. Um, just getting back to the roots and, and grinding out a recovery week with still a good, a good long run and a back to back. So. You know, a 20 into an 11 isn't that bad for just a recovery week. Um, we'll spring right back into next week uh, with some high mileage. And uh, hopefully some beautiful weather. I'm also going to start introducing cycling on my, on my off days. Since the weather is nice, um, and I do love uh, cycling. So you might see a video here and there. About that. Whew. Top of the climb here. It's a good climb. If anybody's looking for a, a decent hill, I really suggest coming here. Baird's Creek, right across the street from the bike parking lot. I don't remember the trail name. Um, but hope you all have a successful week. And I'll see you back here again very soon.